Oh shit, I didn't realize it was recording. Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you have never been here before, my name is Emma Tamsin Hill. Why don't you click that subscribe button, click the bell so you're notified when I upload because it's just a great time here. You know what I mean? I'm, I'm a bit of a laugh. You could say that. I'm a bit of fun. I'm like your sister, your cousin, your best mate. I do videos on all kinds of things like plus size fashion, girl talk advice segments, self love. I do it all mate and you're here for the ride too. Today we are doing a video that so many of you have asked me to do before and when I mentioned doing it on my Instagram, which you should follow because I post all kinds of things to do in my YouTube on there as well. So if you ever want to say on what kind of videos I'm going to upload next, go over there. But I mentioned doing this a while ago on my Instagram stories and so many of you really wanted me to do it. And it is a Simi Shoes haul. Simi Shoes is like a London based online footwear retailer. They kind of specialize in heels. They're kind of like the public desire, the ego, the, that kind of thing in their realm. I'd always looked at Simi Shoes and thought they are stunning, absolutely love it. But my fat wide foot <laughs> would never in a million years fit into any of their shoes. Maybe they would, but I never tried it. You know, when you have wide feet, you kind of just roll stuff out. You think that's not gonna fit, I'm not gonna bother. But lo and behold, the Lord came down, answered my prayers, and Simi Shoes launched a wide fit range. Now, I was buzzing when this happened, okay? And they had messaged me on Instagram and said, oh, we would love to invite you to our launch party for our wide fit collection. And I was like, yes, mate, I'm there. So I went to the launch party. It was great. It was lovely. And also they gifted me some of these pairs of shoes I'm going to show you today. I bought three pairs myself, but I've been gifted, I think about four pairs, which is incredible. Thank you so much, Simi Shoes, for gifting me those pieces. Now, the Wide Fit collection, it actually is pretty vast. There's probably about, let me, I'm just looking at my laptop because I'm going to show you how many things there are. There are 96 pairs of shoes on there, which is quite a big Wide Fit range. There is heels, boots, I don't think there's any flats. There's like a couple of like smaller sandaly type heels. Yeah, heels, boots everything and they have some incredible styles on there most wide fit shoes you know sometimes they'll be kind of but these are like sexy cute classy going out heels party party heels your foot looking sexy kind of heels okay so today we're going to be trying some of them out i've tried them all on already and i can't wait to give you my authentic opinion on this brand but before we get into that today's video is very kindly sponsored by skillshare so if you've never heard of skillshare it's basically an online platform where you can do courses on all different kinds of things like art photography video editing management skills leadership you can do cooking classes you can literally do anything and it will show you how to do it it's just a great platform for learning new things which i am such a huge believer in learning something new all the time i think you know it's never too late to learn a new skill and skillshare will help you do that so they have thousands of classes on there it's really great for say if you're studying something at university and you kind of want to further that classes about productivity as a lot of you know i'm a business owner and i'm also one of the most unorganized people ever so i'm actually doing some courses about productivity and how to you know make yourself more organized when it comes to your business i'm also taking another class which some of you might be really interested it's about iphone photography and how to take the most professional photos you can on your iphone it's by dale mcmanus and it's really great because he gives his tips as a professional photographer and how you can transfer that into your iphone and get in the best settings possible so Skillshare has very kindly given all of my subscribers free membership for two months if you click the link in my description box. After that, it's around $10 a month, but I'm really enjoying it so far and I think a lot of you will as well. So let's get straight on into the haul. I can't wait to show you all these pieces. Let's do it. This is what the packaging looks like. It's just like a little pink cute box with Simi London on the top. Um, all of the paper says hashtag wide with us you can't really see it but that's what the collection was called like wide with us because it's wide fit you know you get it also i think pretty much every shoe comes with like a little bag on it like a protective bag but yeah let's actually get into the shoes so the first part i have are these little mules i think they're called the kezia 
Kezia wide fit black suede mid block heel mules everything will be listed down below as always but this is what they look like they are just a black suede mule with like two little over the foot straps here and two ones for the toes here i think they're the only shoes that don't fit out of this whole haul which i'm actually very surprised about that this is like the only pair that doesn't fit because trust me i've tried a lot of wide fit shoes and i was expecting not a lot <laughs> but i was really pleasantly surprised in this haul for me i have pretty wide feet like maybe on the top so mules don't really fit me anyway yeah they are a really nice like just black suede i think they do them in rose gold and like an orange snake print the heel height and width is really good they're very very easy to walk in if they fit properly but if you have like a wider on the top kind of foot you might not have fun with these they're like a squared off toe they're really you can't see because i'm wearing black they're really pretty not much else to say about it so oh i just hit myself in the face with it they will be going to the charity shop or a friend or someone you're gonna have to excuse these and i will tell you a story about it in a minute but these are called the kimana wide fit and these are in the nude suede and clear this is what these little bad boys look like so they are just a perspex heel with obviously like nude suede i think they do these in like another color as well like a rose gold and probably a black i wore these on a night out so they are absolutely battered i wore them on a night out in liverpool things happen you know what i mean drinks get spilled whatever so the inside is like discolored as anything i don't know if someone spilt like gr a green shot on me or green drinks i don't know but let me tell you a little secret this perspex is your best friend if you have wide feet this is just so like stretchy and malleable i don't even know like the words to say to describe it it's just very like as you can see like this perspex clear stuff it's just great for wide feet it just fits your little toes in there just perfectly i don't know what it is i don't know why but here we are this ties around the back of the ankle and then obviously just ties around the ankle the strap is very long i struggle sometimes with ankle straps on heels them being way too tight not fitting being very uncomfortable this is really long and it is great so these are completely comfortable the heel height and the width is great the width they're easy to walk in for me and the height yeah i wore these all night on a night out and i wasn't like in pain or anything so these are perfect for like a clubbing shoe but yeah the inside of them has discolored but that is probably my fault the only thing is i've wore these once and like the the glue kind of here you can't really see but it's kind of coming away here you might be able to see can you see that so i mean these are not expensive shoes you get what you pay for at the end of the day there is some like cushioning padding stuff here so that makes them kind of comfy but just be careful i might stick that back down with some like gorilla glue or something just to make sure we're all okay i love the shoe like how it looks and how it fits these actually fit like wide fit shoes like i've literally tried everyone's wide fit shoes new look asos there's a whole bunch more that i can't think of off the top of my head but i'm really really pleasantly surprised by simi you did it you did the damn thing next one so this is the alexia in rainbow snake i got these in a the size eight again they fit really good this is what they look like Ma. these are just a stiletto heel kind of pointed on the front i love the pointedness of them i think it looks really classy and elegant the toe strap fits perfectly it's not digging in you don't have to like oh, wedge it up like it fits well this at the back is also comfortable the only thing i don't really like these strings to like tie it around your ankle they're just a bit as you can see it's very i can't explain it like it's not like a, a shoelace it's not like a tie that's easy to like tie they're very like thick and hard and like plasticky obviously because the material that the shoe is do you know what i mean like it's not very it's not easy to tie up basically like softer strings are easier to tie these are a bit hard and thick and not that easy to tie the color 
of the shoe is beautiful. It's like iridescent pink, green, gold, purple, blue, anything you want. It's like a little alien shoe. I wouldn't usually wear a shoe like this other than if I was like, I don't even know if I wear these to dinner. Like I say, you have your dinner shoes and you have your clubbing shoes. These are definitely a dinner shoe or just a sitting down shoe. You know what I mean? You just got to walk from the car to the restaurant to sit down. This is what this shoe is to me. Especially like if you're a bigger girl, you might struggle walking in stilettos and stuff like that. And it eventually does hurt your feet and ankles because it's like this tiny little thing here, that is supporting like all your weight. Well, obviously I'm this bit too, but you get my gist. Yeah, these are a little bit high for me and I don't tend to wear a stiletto. And if I do, it's like a smaller stiletto. Even though they're a bit hard to tie, they do go around a couple times. It's just tying them like in a bow that you might struggle with. You might wanna tie them at the back, depending on how big your ankles are. I kind of have big ankles-ish. I don't really know, but it goes around a good couple of times. I don't even know the word that I'm looking for. <laughs> they're just, not eat, not tieable, not that easy to tie, okay? Next we have these, which are so interesting. I feel like I've never really seen a shoe like this. Now, I don't really wear wedges that much. When I was younger, I always used to wear wedges. Like when I first started wearing heels, like wedge boots and just wedges, because they were just so easy to walk in. And these are great. So it's like, most wedges, you know, would come from the edge here all the way down. These are kind of a smaller wedge. If you can see, like, it's just this area. So it's very sleek and chic, and it looks very fashionable and cute. By the way, these are called the Nelly Wide Fit Black Snake wedges. Again, the front strap is perspex like that. So it's going to be your best friend if you have big feet because it just stretches and holds your tootsies in. Black faux snake skin, again, on the back and the long strings. These have little metal bits on the end. The other shoe that I just showed previously, this did not have metal bits on the end. And this string is a lot easier to tie than the iridescent stiletto heel. They fit really nice and the strings are gonna really long so you can tie them around your ankle a couple times before tying them in a little bow or whatever you wanna do. But again, I don't think I will be able to wear these all night. They're not as comfy as a normal wedge because your foot, when you think about it, like your foot is like boom. It's kind of quite a steep angle. They are quite a high shoe. If they're a little bit less high, it'd be easier to, you know, walk in and just be in all night. So again, I don't think you would want to go clubbing in these, but these are such a look for a shoe. Like I really love how they look and I think they're beautiful and your foot looks so poised and elegant in them. Yeah, another cute one. So next we have the Elise Wide Fit in Nude. I've been wanting a pair of shoes like this for so long. And some of you might laugh at me and might literally think, what the fuck is that? But, just hear me out, all right? Mm, they're a little pair of Nude Peyton Mules. I don't know why I'm flinging them about in the air. It's like a square toe on the front. All of this bit is clear perspex and it has this little cute stiletto at the back. Yeah, I kind of prefer it if that was like straight down. Maybe if it was like, do you ever see them heels that are like thick and straight but thin, if you know what I mean? Instead of like a, it going in and being like a stiletto. I don't know. I'm not a shoe designer, but you know what I mean? These are so freaking cute, but I cannot put these shoes on with just bare foot. Like my foot doesn't go in it because this perspex is like stick. It's not sticky, but you know what I mean? Like your foot would stick to that. My foot doesn't fit in it without like socks on. So you need something slippy to like slide your foot in. I don't know like if I was to actually properly try to put these on like i don't know if i'd have to like talc my feet or like baby oil my feet but either way you're going to see it through the perspex so that's a worry for me like i guess you could wear like i don't even know you know like nude tights but you couldn't because your toes are out here so it's kind of like a lose 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 battle if anyone has any tips let me know because they do fit, like they are wide enough, which again, I'm shocked at because mules and wide feet don't really mesh that well. I can only fit them on with a sock on. <laughs> I don't know. Either way, when I had them on with my socks on, they're very comfy. You could easily wear these all night just because they are small. You know what I mean? It's not a big surface area, but because the heel is small, you'll be okay. Like these are a very 90s shoe. Do you know what I mean? I feel very clueless, but I can't really wear them. 
because I'm not, I'm definitely not wearing socks with them. I hope you didn't laugh too much at the little cutaway video of my white socks with these shoes. <laughs> They're going back, love. I've got no choice. I love these little dust bags though. Let me add, a lot of the shoes which are still at a heel do come with a little bag with more bottoms on. So these are if you lose or ruin the little end of your shoe here, you can stick another one on. Next, these are like my favorite shoes at this whole haul. Oh, these are the Shauna Nude Paint and Python heels. This is what they look like. They are just a like a peachy i don't like to use the word nude okay when we say nude and it's this color this isn't nude for everyone do you know what i mean like nude is universal so i like to say like i don't know blush taupe peach i don't know mm, mm. these are sublime honestly so it's just like a faux snake skin kind of thing in this peachy color Big, thick, chunky heel, which makes it so easy and comfortable to walk in. Again, it has like the squared off toe, and this is nice and big. Like, this is what I struggle with, with most heels. Like, most heels will fit me, whatever, but it's the ankle strap and this bit that either dig in and kill and just hurt, and it just doesn't work. So these are absolutely perfect. I've never found a brand where, like, all the wide fit shoes were actually consistently fitting well on a, a wide foot like I have. I feel like that's quite a bit of room, you know? Again, the ankle strap was good. I had it on like the first hole and it wasn't too tight. It was great. Yeah, man, that's what they look like. And I love them. You could easy wear these all night to the club. They're such a good staple heel as well because they will go with everything. Yeah, I feel to get these in black as well. Finally, the piece de resistance of the haul. Something that I know you will all love and be waiting to see. These are the Rochelle black suede thigh high boots. Wide fit thigh high boots, you heard me correct. It's just a black suede booty. The front is kind of, kind of squared, kind of rounded. It's a nice shape, very nice. The heel is nice and thick and chunky, not too high. I would say a little bit too high for like a boot, but some people like high boots. I can easily walk in them, they're fine. I don't know if they will be comfy like for hours and hours and hours on end, but they definitely are comfortable. There is a zip that goes from here all the way up here. So you can unzip that, put the boot on from the top and then zip that up. I have big legs. Let me tell you, I have big legs and big thighs and that zipped up fine and it wasn't horrendously tight feeling horrible it was very good and i'm very very surprised and pleased with it the top of the boo is like this fit my big old thigh in it impressed and the material is nice and stretchy as well and then at the back it has this where you can you know tighten it up tighten it to make sure the boot stays around your thigh I got these on okay, it was it was a tiny bit of a faff to get them on, but nothing major that you would think for a boot like this on big legs. The actual boot fit really nice. You know what, it was a tiny bit big. Let me see what size I got. I got a nine, so I'm really an eight and a half, so I'd rather go bigger than go smaller, do you know what I mean? The zip actually feels like really nice quality. Again, these are not 200 pound boots. They're not gonna be incredible quality, but for what it is, they are great. I'm gonna check how much they are now. These are 50 pound and you could probably get a discount potentially on some shoes. I think that's quite good for what they are, but I did have a walk around in them. So I put them on and was walking around the flat to see if they would roll down and they did roll down. I have big thighs though. So if you don't have thighs as big as me, you might be okay, but they didn't roll down like horrendously. I was on my own, so I didn't really like do up the back as best as I potentially could have done. This is good because you really can like make it tight and everything, but they rolled down to just about like on my knee instead of like on my thigh, you know what I mean? So it wasn't anything major. They didn't look bad at all in my opinion. I like them though. I feel like a spy in them or like I don't you like some bad bitch that's just what I feel like in these I've never ever tried on a pair of thigh high boots or even like knee high boots because I just always assumed they would never be right like when you have wide feet and you have big legs you kind of just rule these things out so if you have both of those like me and you've been searching for a pair of thigh high boots these are great 
so that was everything that I had to show you all today. I really hope you enjoyed this video. It was like my first kind of shoe focus video that I've done, especially on like wide fit shoes. Cause I know a lot of you do have wide fit, a lot of plus size girls, boys in general do. I hope I have shone a light on a new brand for you all. My final thoughts are that the brand has really done something new for like wide fit shoes in a way of like, there's not very many places out there that do like cute, girly, sexy, finger snap bad bitch heels. So I'm really pleasantly surprised. And the way that these all fit was absolutely perfect for me. Although the first pair didn't fit, I've tried a lot of shoes in the past and they've just gone straight back because they don't fit even though they say they're wide fit. These genuinely, I do feel like they are wide fit and I'm really happy with them and I will continue to buy from the Simi Shoes wide fit range. Everything, it'll be down in the description box as always, all the links and sizes and everything that I have worn. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Also, don't forget to check out Skillshare. There is a link in my description box for it. It's really helpful and really useful. I'm really enjoying it, so I hope a lot of you will enjoy it as well. I will see you very soon for a new video. Thank you for watching. Make sure you click that subscribe button. I'm waiting. I'm sat here patiently waiting until you click it because like I know you're you're sat here you're not subscribed you're thinking mm, this girl's a bit click it babe I know you want to see me again okay bye <laughs>